Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel Tectrix World. The drive letter for your new USB or external hard drive is not set in stone and if you feel the itch to change it, it rather simple process. Changing the driver letter in Windows 10 works the same as it done for Windows version 8, 7, Vista and XP. Even drive C is technically changeable but definitely not recommended. Alright, all you have to open up disk management. First, ensure that the letter you want to assign to the driver is not currently in use. Next, you can open disk management from a few different sources. Right click the start button in the left side corner or press windows button plus X. To open the power user menu, select disk management from the menu provided. To open from CMD, press window button plus R. To pull up the run function, type in CMD and hit enter to bring up the command prompt. Type in disk MGM dot msc and hit enter to pull up the disk management from the disk management console window right click on the volume that has the drive letter you want to change to ensure it is the correct drive tap and hold down the left click button over the drive and then choose explore you can also right click to the driver and choose explore if easier you can look through the available folders to see if the correct drive has been chosen once you acknowledge that it is indeed the drive you wish to change right click the drive and choose change drive letter and path in the window that appears click the change button this will open the change drive letter and path window click the assign the following drive letter drop down to have a list of available drive letters presented to you you should avoid a and b as these particular letters has been historically reversed for floppy drivers and choose confuse older software by being alerted choose the one from the list you prefer and click ok a pop-up should appear with a message some programs that rely on the drive letters might not run correctly do you want to continue click yes once the change is complete you can close the disk management console so that's all for today i hope you enjoyed this video if you find this video helpful then make sure to like share and subscribe to our channel and do check out our more videos thanks for watching Meet you in next video. Till then, bye bye.